Hello, beautiful. Hello. Can I have a moment of your time? Are you worried about my time? I really hope so. I am Marcus. I am Cinderella. You have five minutes. <laughs> okay. Um, are you all alone? Yeah, sure. Care for a drink or something? As long as you're not the one mixing. <laughs> of course, I'm not the one. So, what are you taking? A glass of wine will be okay. Okay. Bartender, glass of wine. <laughs> you know, that's a sign of a complicated woman, indeed. And I feel I'm going to try harder than this. You know. <laughs> so, want to tell me why you're all here alone? I love spending time with myself. Mm. It feels mm. it is refreshing. And I think everyone needs some time alone, away from the world. Am I making sense? Of course, you are a motivational speaker. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Anyways, maybe or maybe not, but I feel those words need to be. And you have interrupted my alone time today, too. And guess what? I'm not sorry. And I can see that. <laughs> but by the way, uh, why are you here all alone? <laughs> I mean, a fine guy like you must be having a lady out there waiting to caress you. You know what I mean, right? <laughs> I wish. I just wish. <laughs> but you know, I had a very hectic day at work, and this is my first time in this place. And I just decided to hang out, relax. And here am I, speaking to a beautiful lady. <laughs> but you know what? We can get to know ourselves better. Hang out during the weekends, or, you know, I'm a very good cook, so I can cook for you. Hey, hey, slow your roll, <laughs> Tiger. What makes you think I want to know where you live? Don't you want to know, Cindy? Point taken. <laughs> Anyways, um, I think we should be leaving. Let me let me just drive you home. And why would I want to split that to the other meal? Stop playing hard to get down. Come on, let's go. Come in. Hey bro, what's up? My bro. What's up? Good man. How are you? I'm good bro. How's you? How's it going? I'm good. And you? Uh man scoping man. You know this morning finding thing now. <laughs> yeah, I know, eh? It's all over. Yeah man. But I hope you're making time for God and all these smackers. Yes. I don't understand, bro. <laughs> Marcos, Ecclesiastes is still a Remember your creator. In the days of thy youth? No man, are you forgetting that I'm the son of a church leader? Bro, come on. <laughs> hey, hey, I can talk for you. This one is good, eh? Of course, you know to hear this. I met a lady. Ha! Another one? What? Mm. what? I'm, I'm just astonished. Come on, man. Listen, listen. This one is different. She's so different. I love her spirit and we vibe so much, you know? <laughs> Marcos, you know, even say it to you, you baby. Forget about these ladies. Let's just focus. Yes. Ah! 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 They said it! They, they said what? They said it! Ah! They said that my enemy of progress is within my circle. Ah, oh, Zach! I didn't know it was you! Oh my god! Of course, I'm the one after the destiny. Ah! Ah! You feel little? Ah! Marcos, let's, let's just focus. <laughs> Bro, you think I'm joking, right? Okay, guy, let's let just clear you before you come with all the scripture then to me. You see this guy? I'm going to screw her in you. 
I'm going to test her enough to know if her engine is as good as my car's engine. So no, no, I will. <laughs> Marcos, you're not going to change. You know what? I'll just manage you. <laughs> like we God works on you. That's the only thing, bro. <laughs> Let's keep praying for you. <laughs> this is my disappointment, please. Ah. Let's just talk about the needs for the last meeting. Oh, let me show you. What's up? Hey, wait a minute. Have you quitted your job? You've not been to the office for days, man. No, bro. Um, you know, I've just been trying to spend quality time with Cinderella, you know. And uh, she's here with me. <laughs> this Cinderella lady. <laughs> I thought you were going to eat at one. This they don't put on a bottle. <laughs> really? Come on, man. <laughs> How's it going? I'm good. Just be watchful out there and make sure you don't forget to pray. Thank you for always being here. Appreciate Anytime, brother. And she's so heartbroken. I didn't know what else to do, so I invited her out to cheer up. Please. Cindy, you didn't tell me. I know. The only reason I'm coming down is because this is one good part of you that I love. And I think it's one of the reasons I fell in love with you. you know? mm -hmm. That is the only reason, but please don't do it next time. Okay, thank you, sweetheart. Come, so just come. let me introduce you to her. Good. Marcos. Yeah. This is Beatrice. Beatrice, Marcos. Hi, Marcos. Nice meeting you. I hope you get well soon. I hope so too. Yeah. So. What's up with you and this guy? I hope you're not trying to lead him on. No, no, I think I like him. What? <laughs> like, seriously? Yeah. Are you joking right now or what? Wait, have you told him yet? Hey, 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 it's not your role, baby girl. We are not here to talk about me. We are here to talk about you. I mean, you are the one depressed. And you think 
this is not an issue. I know, Beatrice, but let's forget about me for now. Let's talk about you. <laughs> Cindy, I have been through a lot. And what, what's happening right now in my marital life is not surprising at all. I have treated men. I have treated people unfairly. And today, I am reaping the fruits of the seeds that I sowed. Cindy, I don't want you, I don't want you to go through the same thing. I did claim to be a good Christian, yet, my life was never an example. I lived a very loose life. And I, and I had to learn my lessons in a very hard way. Cindy, Cindy, make me be the dirty box for you. So you will learn from my story and from my experience. Do not allow yourself to be a tool for Satan's agenda. Cindy, be an example and make a difference in your world. Cindy, you know I love you. I love you so much. And I don't want you to go through the same thing that I went through. Please, I love you so much, my friend. I love you. <laughs> it's okay. That is why we call it work, okay? And you are so annoying, not being encouraging at all. <laughs> That's me. Anyways, how is your, your friend, sister, the one I met at the restaurant yesterday? Hope she's pulling through today. Yeah. Hmm. She's trying to be good. She's a strong woman. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, Cindy about meeting my parents. Yeah. How are you feeling? Mixed feeling. Okay. Scared, ah. happy, and not knowing what would be the outcome. <laughs> I think I'm interested in knowing why you're scared. Well, you know, African parents can be super tight and protective of mm. their children, mm. especially mothers with their sons. Oh. <laughs> well, mm, let's see. <laughs> no, 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 that was a good one. But can we pray, please? Father, we thank you for this food. And we thank you for the unity to be here. We bless you, oh God, as we are about to partake, Father. Give us the necessary appetite and may we enjoy this food in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. <laughs> wow. Amen. Mm. 
That... Does mom still refuse to put salt in the food she puts? <laughs> you know your mother. Yeah, she has her old fancy saying that um, the salt, the rat, and the rice they are poor neighbors. <laughs> you know? But <clears throat> she has been adding a little lately <laughs> for my sake. Imagine, after 22 years, 22 years of pleading with them. Don't mind your dad, my son. He can be annoying sometimes. I'm just stating the fact. It's not the fact. Anyways, so that is my troublesome sister, Malia. I hope, hope, hope she's doing fine. She's doing okay. She's doing okay. And in fact, we spoke to her this morning. Yes. We even told her that you'll be bringing somebody over. Oh, wow. Don't you two talk? Well, mom, you know my tight schedule is late. I lost my phone in that car today. It's been a while. Don't worry, I'll text her number to you. I should be back pretty soon. the best, mama. Thank you. <coughs> so, Sinaya, my dear. Yes, sir. Are you okay? So tell me, what did you do? I am the acting MD of Donald Fraser and Google Communities. Wow. And I serve as a tourist at my local church. That's impressive. I know it's very, very impressive. Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you. Sir. Keep it up, keep it up, my dear. Mm. I hope you two are not sleeping together yet. Oh! Not at all, ma. Marcus has been teaching me to face boundaries, so we should not go against the doctrines of the Bible concerning courtship and marriage. Wow! I'm very proud of you, my son. That's my son. That's my son. It's look after me, Kim. <laughs> <laughs> Sister so, Cinderella, tell me, how poor are your parents doing? Sorry, my dear. I sympathy. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, okay? Just well. My dear, this way. But she can look on us now, right? Exactly. I'm willing to be a father to you. Exactly. See me as your father. And you can see her as a mother, alright? Exactly. Okay. Come on, let me just make. Alright? Alright. So <clears throat> and I also want to use this opportunity to officially welcome you to the family. So, I think we can now have a toast to happy life. Cheers! God, what have I gotten myself into? This was just for fun, but now it's getting all serious. How do I tell him at this point? I wonder how he will react. Oh no. Are his feelings real? Or will he flee when things get hard? Wait. He might even be one of those church boys that goes around sleeping with women. But I've fallen for him already. 
no. Is any of it real? What if all this is a lie? What if he's just using his world and trying to treat me for one of his past misfortunes? But when a man takes you to his parent, he can only be serious. God help me. What should I do now? In fact, everyone know men can present for ages and go just far, just to get what they want from you. Oh God, please help me. than the hardness. By the way, how's the situation with you and that guy? Um, Marcus, you mean? Hmm. Ha! Sister. <laughs> Have you told him yet? Hello? No, not yet. Cinderella. Cinderella, you have to be careful. Life has many phases to offer. And whatever you give will eventually come back to you. My dear friend, please figure it out soonest and make the right decision. I'm always here for you, sister. Okay? In all cases, everything will be fine. All right. You have a nice day. I love you. You know you have grown a lot, right? But I did when I left. Of course you were. Come on. Listen, listen. I think probably because you have spent a lot of years out of the country, you think you are older than me now. No matter how old you grow. You will always be my baby girl. I'm not your baby girl. You are my baby boy. <laughs> Salon Baba. <bubble. laughs> anyways, anyways. How was your flight? It was bumpy, really. Wow. But thank God it's a miracle I made it, though. Okay. So Please don't say anything to mom and dad about this. Please. I was just thinking about it, but don't worry. Please. Look at how you make your face. I wouldn't. Anyways, I know you're tired. I'm so tired. But I guess the ferry will land in no time for me. I want to go home. Town vibe, free town vibe. I, I remember the olden days, man, where we used to go out, spend some time together. Oh, yeah. But anyways, good we'll, to be back there. We'll, we'll, we'll be landing very soon, and you get to experience the vibe again. Okay, okay.
said, Hask him upon your knees. Bless the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost in him. I make my voice cause to praise him. It's my new foe. Let me see your hands go. Oh, all right. If you love me, say yo. Let me see your hands go. Oh, big world. Wow. Why are you going dressed like something to me? Oh, I thought you said you were tired. I'm not rested now, so. I'm going now, be back in the GF, please. Can I go? Mm. Jesus to Savior, I said, big up, 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 to be my wife in a few months. God. <laughs> ah, ah, do yourself a favor and just lose my number. Because the day you call me, I will kill you. And your blood will not be in my hands. She was just a stupid mistake. Very really stupid. Really? I love Marcus. Very really stupid. This is not a stupid mistake. <laughs> but you were saying that last night, girl. You stay out of this. She has every right to be part of this conversation. <laughs> you messed with her, let her on, and slept with her last night. And now you are saying she's not part of the conversation? You know what, Cindy? I'm already disappointed. I'm heartbroken. You have just messed me up. Thank you. My God's way! You believe I know how to impossible! Little 
me something important that you wanted to discuss with me. So tell me, what is it? Dad. What I'm about to discuss with you, it's going to be so shocking, hurting, and frustrating. As a matter of fact, I've gone astray. Oh my God, for me, you cannot go astray myself. <coughs> no, I've, I've really gone astray. No, no, you've not gone, gone astray. Gone astray listen, that. listen. I want you to calm down, okay? Calm down and talk to me like a man, all right? Tell me, what really happened? Dad, mm -hmm. thank you for not only being a dad to me, but also a friend. I feel I've confided in you a lot and it has helped me. And I've learned that with age comes with wisdom and maturity comes sure, sure. understand. Sure. But Dad, Cinderella. She said on me. And, and she didn't only just cheat on me with a man. She cheated on me with a woman. What? Can you imagine? And I caught them red and dead, Dad. And, and, and the, fo the funny thing about everything is she's acting with no remorse. And, and she's, she's all over the place. After I decided to get married to that girl, after I gave her my all, I promised to marry her. I came with her here to introduce her to you and mom. I don't remember. And she had the guts to do this to me, dad. She did this to me. And you know, <clears throat> she pretended as if she was that kind of a humble, God fearing lady. First of nowadays. What's on? Listen to me. I know your hearts and I know how you feel right now. Certain things that happen to, to us in life, God uses us as prototypes. I don't know if you are understanding me. And He uses us as a prototype so that people will learn from our mistakes. And they will not do the same mistake that we did. So I want you to see this as a lesson. Let me tell you a story. When I was in college, there was this lady I met. She was so beautiful. Like she was everything I was looking for in a woman. Trust me, I thought she was the one. I was sure in my mind that she was the one. Rachel was beautiful. And at graduating year, I found out that she was with somebody else. And he eventually got married and he looked. Oh, I was devastated. I felt like my world was crashing down. But that was when I came across the scripture, Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5 and 6 which says, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge Him and He shall direct your path. Again, I know this hurts, but I want you to calm down myself, okay? And just trust in God to direct whatever you do. I love you so much. Your mother loves you so much. And above all, God loves you so much. And we are proud of you.
Boy, what's up? Wait, are you alright? Is this alcohol you're drinking? Did someone die? Zach. Zach? Yeah? I'm finished, bro. How can you say that? You're right. How about what? Cindy, you used me. She used me and dumped me. I wish I had been wrong. All this while. It's like I didn't know at all, bro. What? Wait a minute. We were already planning for a wedding. Bro. She's sleeping with Malia. What? My sister, bro. This is worse than anything I could have imagined. It turns out they had a relationship all this time. Dear God. I don't even know what to say. Zach, the interesting thing is I caught them red handed. Oh my red God. handed. And I cannot unsee this. I keep thinking and seeing it every other day in my mind, bro. <laughs> but wait a minute. I hope you didn't do anything stupid. I couldn't, bro. I couldn't. I was just in shock, man. I know it's out of character, but that's silly. I feel so bad towards her right now. But you know what? I have an idea. I know what to do. Well, well, well. well. Be not, be not deceived. For, for God is not mocked. No, bro. For whatever a man so well. No, 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 bro, no, 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 no. I know that, but that's not what's going to bring solution here, man. Come on. I feel so much anger and frustration right now, bro. And I'm going to make every single woman pay for this. Marcos, you cannot cast the same judgment upon all women. The same road, it's just a matter of time, man. That's a dangerous stance, Marcos. All I know is no girl will ever, ever break my heart again, bro. How can you guarantee that? Oh, ah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I listen to this song. <laughs> I'm not going to invest myself emotionally anymore. Do it. If a dog bites you and you bite back, what does that make you? A clever dog. A clever dog. So Marco, there's nothing I can do to change your mind towards this. I'm not sure, bro. They should pay. So I'm not sure they see business look bad means to the same. Today my old list, yeah, nobody know about it. You know say you know see yesterday a bad business. Say nobody bad business, Sam. Um. Nobody bad business, Sam. Um. Nah, they can't go sleep. Sam, why people go sleep? Oh, no people go sleep right now. Wait, 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 wait. One two need they come. This is for sure. Sam, this is for sure. This is for sure. Sam, where did the guy go? Come on, 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 so how's that you pull left? Look, look, you, look, you, look, you, look, you, look, 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 anyway, Lord, just go back. Yeah. Look, 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 look
So you can stay. The Bible says, the kingdom of heaven suffer in marriage, and the marriage is taken to my boss. And it's not a temple, bitch. You cannot go black. Look at you. Inspector Marcos Dalinti. And I'm sorry to say that you are under arrest. Under arrest? What time did I commit? Young lady, I beseech you not to say anything. For whatever word you use right now will be used against you in the court of law. Excuse me, what time did I commit? You see, this is a public gathering. And I would really, really ask you not to make a scene here. Just kind Sir, of follow me right to the police station. Sir, I know my fundamental rights. I'm not going anywhere if you not tell me the plan that I mm. You really want to know your crime? You really want to know your crime? Really want to know your crime? You really want to know your crime? The crime you committed is that you carry your duty. Are you even serious? Because. <laughs> Do you know who had just left my body? Oh, really? <laughs> that was what's up. Oh, boy. <laughs> Anyways, my name is Marcus Darling. It's a pleasure knowing you. You look so beautiful. Okay, come here. Blah blah blah, no. I marched her out of my house. Bro, women are scum. They are scum. And you know what? I can't even imagine. I will treat this one I met yesterday. <laughs> I will run pull pull her hey, 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 my man, slow down. Come on. I know you're hot. You've been wrong, but are you forgetting who you are? <laughs> and your identity in Christ? Come on, man. <laughs> Do not be conformed to the things of this world. This too shall pass, the man. I didn't make so. I will pass a hero. Come on, we have what I have to do. Ah. Wait, are way? you blind? That's no. a dumb question. Oh, yeah, you're a bush girl. Come on. I know you Excuse women. Me? I know you women. Oh, you ask the victim and you behave like you're the one right. Seriously? Oh, so apparently all women are bad drivers, huh? Oh, huh? yes. I said so. You know what? I, I guess your education was for nothing but because you don't think like my grandfather in the village. Oh, wow. I wish your dad can pay me my bills, sir. <laughs> Come on. Well, I can't stop now, sir. I knew she was a woman. This idiot just hit my car. Oh really? I did. Are you blind? Are you not seeing? Make the baby motor car. What's argument? 
Just like that. Yes, not scared me. Oh wow. Yes. Okay. Well, this young man just gave you the right. But you know what? Come, come. Hey, hey, where do you think you're going? Come back here. What are you doing? You know what? You know what? Here's my card. You get to call me and we'll fix up your car. Seriously? Hey, come back here. Come oh, here. Okay. Don't worry. I have a very important meeting. I'm already working. And I have work to do as well, bro. My schedule is packed up. I'm going to be driving red car right now. I, I don't want Where any do you take me from? Come back here. Hey! Hey! You idiot! Come on, fix my car! So, so guy, guy, what, what, what would it cost to, you know, mend broken parts? Seriously? I don't know. You're not even going to ask what is wrong? My dear, I just dented your car. Why is that even relevant to ask? Really? No, I don't know speak English. Motzka, when I don't go bang, when I don't pull like, the motzka is involved with the hard drive. Look at all the pull. The motzka in process will get problem. I knew it. He, 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 he speak English. I knew it. Marcus <laughs> have serious. destroyed my car. I don't see your owner. I don't speak English, Lalo. Wait, wait. I knew your car had preliminary issues before an incident. Don't put this all on me. Really? Okay, 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 okay. Listen, guy, guy. What were you saying? What, what you mean? Talk Creole. I don't hear English. What do you mean? But. So Sir, Marcus. what happened? The motor done done. Oh. All of me here has found this work over 10 years experience. Hey. I never see this guy motor. Hey, ah. It's not enough <laughs> that you're ruining my day. I don't know, no, I don't know the motor done done. The motor done for recycling processor. Look here. The processor is here. You understand? Oh eh? my goodness. Marcus, this so guy, one that he just speak English. Me, go back and tell him that you, your plans you, won't fail. Calm down. Really? You, you, you both want to You're even it. shouting? Please. Oh my god. Oh my god. Calm down, guy. Calm down, guy. You do love to see my other color. Guy, guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's guy mechanic you be? What do you mean, the motor on down? So, so now you want to teach me, me? No, 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 teach me. Motor, wait. <laughs> this guy, no. I don't want to show okay, me, Sorry, sorry. If this motor, it says, say the processor. Marabio in motor, then. Wait, it lasts by. I mean, they repair them. Which ah. guy is this? They're not sorry about me. <laughs> Look, this guy. Okay. I did say about valve. Look, the valve. Now, this valve will connect to the. The Motzka in brain box. Now if you look this plug down at the Chinese plug and fix this. So. My goodness. Is this, is this, your, is this your, your mechanic? I don't know, I don't know. What, 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 what are you explaining? Okay, okay. You're okay. not gonna understand. Okay, okay. You're not gonna understand. Is purpose. Okay, you're not gonna understand. I knew it. This is my card. Please okay. just get to me and let me pay you whatever it costs. Now 15 million for repair. Because we got for panel from the under. The panel are under who lift up. You understand? Just get back to me and let me know what I should pay. Mm -hmm. I'm going. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. And where do you think you're going? You just want to leave me here? How do you expect me to get home? Her Majesty. Can we go? That's better. So, did you die? Here. It's been good, man. It's been busy. A lot. A lot going on, man. A lot. I understand. Tent. Yeah. Where is she? Sorry for my manners, bro. This is our best. I met a few days ago, my brother. A best? <laughs> <laughs> what a gorgeous best she is. Mm. Please don't is go there, my one? brother. Please don't go there. Please don't go there. This one, she will bury you and dance on top of your grave. 
I doubt that. <laughs> she seems nice to be old. Oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Looks like you inherited all the charms from your family. Mm. He's my best friend, please. Ah. And here I thought I was your best friend. I'd rather be tortured. What? My ah. man, calm down. She's not that bad. Please. Oh, yeah, Please. I am. Ah. Well, our kingdom does well to have bad people. Mm. Oh. Hmm. What kingdom? God's kingdom. Oh? Really? Well, I am part of that kingdom as well. A proud Jesus girl. That's it. Marcos, have you seen what I'm seeing? Marcos, your best friend is good. At least his ideas of starting a conversation is not by hitting my car. Marcos! Here we have it. I can't have rest for this so-called car. But of course, you spoiled my car, isn't it? <laughs> I wish you could see that look on your face right now. I give up, man. Oh, come on now. <laughs> What's the problem? Well, you're looking nice. Yes, I know. Yes, I know. Anyways, um, what's up? You know, I woke up feeling like a boss, so I figured I should dress like one. <laughs> boss? Really? Young lady, you can never be a boss. Ah. That is why I don't like you. Something else. No. I know. <laughs> Anyways, are you busy tonight? Are you just not waiting that I walk at night? Uh, are you crazy or something? What? Why are you asking though? You want to take me out? Relax, just calm down. Zach will be there. Because I know that is music to your ears. Oh, my Prince Charming. Hmm, clearly. Can see. Can see it all over you. Mm -hmm. Wait. You're actually serious? Uh, you trying to say I'm? You both are into each other. We can see everything from 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 the time you knew each other. Both of you are like ports and peas in a pod. <laughs> you know, you are all over each other in the place. Come on. In that case, I hope he's nothing like you. And whatever you mean? You think I don't see the endless heart in your chat list? Oh, <laughs> well that. Boys will always be boys, my dear. <laughs> but I think you can do better. Oh. <laughs> see, mm. life can offer better things than this. Mm. You don't get to be part of those things. Mm. I love you for who you are, but I believe you can offer greater things to the society than this. Just try to do a retrospect of what happened now in your life to what you want to see happening in the next five years. Oh, please. Okay. Whatever. Let's go. All right. I'm enjoying the ride. You should. We need to go around on it for come around with a lead in the rotation. Yeah! Don't feel it, it's blue, they're not getting it. I'm back when I'm so ready, they do. So, so when are you going to take her out? Oh, Michelle? <laughs> you play too much, bro. You know it's not like that. Is that so? Come on. Since I introduced her to you, you two are like, he's in a pod. You are the only one that doesn't get angry with her. Oh, no. Why is that? I guess we are just trying to be friends. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but why the sudden interest? Are you... No! <laughs> Come on, Marcos. 
I'm just concerned, bro. I just don't want to be like a third wheel because if you guys guys get close, I'll always be the third wheel. I don't want to find myself in that situation. No, but I I I, I guess you're just trying to build a wall around for you not to fall in. Due to your past relationship with Cindy, my guy. Take things easy. It's too well. Listen. Let's forget about this, bro. Can you hear the song? Mmm. about him he's a fine gentleman but I just think he's a player I thought you would not know this to all oh well I am that smart I still believe in him though I I'm yeah. sure God has a great purpose for him. Yeah. Just imagine what I've been through all my life with Marcos. <laughs> he just needs to open his heart and ask God to help him change yeah. his ways. We just need to pray for him. I know Marcos too well to give up on him now. Wow. This well. Is it your is car repaired yet? Yeah, it's almost done. I, I, I'll get it by the end of this week. Oh, okay, fine. Why did you just bought me water? Can you please order yes. something for me? Waiter, please. We they move, we they move. God in people, then they move. We not get nothing else to prove. God in people, then they move. Exodus. 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 Surprised to see the text last night. Yes. Oh, poor is rough. We needed to see. Hmm. Okay. Where should I start? Hmm. All right. You know about lighthouse transportation? Of course. That's my dad's company. Okay, so your dad is Mr. Ayodele Valente. Yes. Michelle, this is all. Your dad wants to hand over the company to you. No. What? Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. Why am I knowing this now? In fact, why am I even hearing this from you? Calm down, Marcus. Wait, how did you even know my dad? Calm down, Marcus. And listen. Okay. Calm down, guy. Calm down, calm down. Right. You see, I've been working for your dad for the past seven years now. Well, if proving yourself competent enough, <laughs> so there's another responsibility. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, you see, uh, I'm planning on um, handing the company and the church organization to my eldest son. Um, but he has not been himself lately. I've been hearing rumors of his 
actions um, around that does not resonate with how we grew up. Oh. But I believe um, what God is saying concerning his life mm -hmm. and being that you are an experienced disciple to me all these years, I would love for you both to meet so that you you will share your experiences with him and um, help get him ready for the next phase of his life. Yeah. Oh, okay, Daddy. It will be a pleasure. I don't know him, though. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, here, here's his card. Right. Yes, you, you just, just tell him that... Uh, Marcus? What, do you know him? Oh, not, not really, sir. The name just ring a bell. Oh, right, okay. I, uh, just tell him that it's regarding the company's plan, all right? Okay, okay. I will, Daddy. Okay, with you. You know, I was, I was shocked as well to know that you are his son. Let's conclude that our meeting was the right. So when when I get home, I did some research about you. Thank you for work. I, I just gave you a report. Listen, this is more than a report. It's not just a report. You see, from the day you came into my space, I knew God was up to something. I felt it. It was visible. Even though I've been far away from Him, He has always kept His promises. He's always stood by me. I built the wall when I started getting closer to you. I didn't want to be, you know, a victim of another lie. But the truth is, Michelle, I love you. I really do. I've never seen a clearer part of my life until the day I met you. God has used you in imaginable ways, in an unimaginable way that you have not even noticed, seen or known. And you have aided my transformation into turning around into a new person that God's what God wants me to be. Thank you for the encouragement and all He didn't judge me, but you, you showed, you showed, me, you showed me love, the Christ-like love that I've never experienced before. And you know what? I saw Jesus through you. I did, and now I am ready to make that turn. I've 
have received Jesus again. This is because a lot of people said a lot of things about me, not knowing exactly what I was and what I am going through. You and my friend Zach, you guys too by me. Thank you so much, Michelle. Thank you. I don't have words to say that will really express my gratitude. But I appreciate you. Thank you. Can we pray? Say 